Late Monday morning in Northeast Portland's Madison South neighborhood, we spotted a man who appeared to be a plainclothes detective. In all likelihood, he was following up on the deadly shooting that happened late Sunday night. Uh, just one gunshot, if anything. But this man, who did not want to share his name, lives in the neighborhood and heard the gunfire. We're told officers responded to the scene and tried to save the victim's life, but they were unsuccessful. It's, it's, it is disheartening, the loss of life and the violence and, you know, people not feeling safe in the neighborhood anymore. Turns out the man shot and killed Sunday night is not the first person gunned down at Northeast 82nd and Milton in recent months. It seems to be a regular occurrence in this neighborhood. You might recall in August of last year, two rappers affiliated with the Wu-Tang Clan were shot and killed. And in January of this year, a man by the name of Aaron Williams was murdered, his mother telling us this at the time. It's wrong. You don't shoot people and leave them like cattle that you've, or pigs that you've hunted. Authorities tell KGW that in addition to the four people killed in the Madison South neighborhood in the last eight months, another half dozen people have been shot and injured. We're told the focused intervention team and the enhanced community safety team are aware of the shootings and working on a plan to address the violence. Well, that's new information to me, but yeah, that would, anything would be helpful. It certainly would. People in this neighborhood will tell you they've had enough of the gun violence. I hope it calms. I hope, you know, I hope it calms all over the city. That's what everyone is looking for. All right, a last check. There have been no arrests in any of the four homicides near Northeast 82nd and Milton. As always, if you have any information, you should contact the Portland Police Bureau. And remember, you can do so anonymously.